So can you deliver your home state, Ted? Uh, no, I can't. But uh, you know, but I think Bernie Sanders has a real good chance Please of winning here because his message resonates, I think, with people in Rhode Island. She, uh, Shailene Woodley. Bernie's message is a rigged economy held in place by a corrupt system of campaign finance. People in Rhode Island understand what that's all about. Being a Rhode Islander, yeah. what are the specific challenges of, of winning Rhode Island? For well, a progressive. Well, I, I you know, I, I, I think the challenge is, you know, the Institutional Democratic Party here in Rhode Island is obviously with Hillary Clinton. Is, so so we're up against, you know, the, the, the Institutional here. Party apparatus. And that's the big challenge. And what awesome. we've got to do well, is get new people into the process, young people in, you independents in. If we can do that, matter. then, then we've got a real good job winning here. How do you think the media did you in Rhode Island? How did they treat you in Bernie Sanders? I think very well. I think we've had a very good reception from the media. Here. We did a lot of local citizens. interviews this Crazy morning. Me. That was really yeah. good opportunity for we me to get this message out to people who live here. So we've had a we've had a good uh, you know Brooklyn, good chance to talk to people Democrats through the media here in Rhode Island. Yeah, yeah, good. So you used to be part of that political establishment <laughs> that you're now <laughs> kind of well, trying to upset. Well, listen, I've, I've, worked, I've worked for Bernie Sanders for 20 years. Our greatest defense against tyranny is our right to vote. I'm very proud to be part of this campaign and have the opportunity to build. What he's built here, they all not us, just here in Rhode Island, but all across the country. And do you still consider CNN Joe Palino a friend, even I though he's mischaracterizing your candidate no, as a no, socialist? No, 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 no. Listen, Joe and I went to high school together. We've known each other for a long time. We obviously have different views in this election, but no, no, I consider him a long-time friend. I do.